<laughs> Hello everybody and welcome to Calico. This is another game that was recommended to me by Sylvia Wood, the same person who recommended Ooblets. So uh, I'm excited to play this because uh, she has some good taste in games, so let's just hop right in. What name? What? Enter a name. Name? No, my name is not name. My name is Yabby. Yes! Confirm. I can't believe I'm starting my new life tomorrow. Ugh, I have to pick something to wear. Ooh. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Close. Oh, I accidentally clicked yes. Ooh. Well, where are we going? Ooh, who are you? There's a bunch of cool characters here. Oh, hi. Hello, Calico. Is that our cafe? Oh, it's me. I don't have any clothes. Oh my gosh! Ah, hello! Welcome to Heart Village. I'm Kiva, the mayor of this little village. We are so excited to have you here. We were all so sad to have your aunt retire and the cafe shut down. Honestly, the village just isn't the same without her. Though she did send me a postcard last week and it looks like she's really enjoying traveling. Apparently there are cats on other islands. Isn't that amazing? Oh, whoops. Of course you'd know all about that, having come from another island. Anywho, all that matters is that you are here now. First things first, why don't you look inside your new cafe? It's a little boring and empty right now, but that's up to you to fix. Why don't you go inside and check the place out? Come back and talk to me when you're done. Oh jeez, wait, even more first, I need to give you your welcome gift. Here's a couple things that will help you settle in. Whoa! Uh, thank you. Oh, it's a calico! Pick up. Hey friendo, did you check out the place? Let me pick up the cat. Let me- Okay. Um, ooh, I can choose? Um, let's go for spooky. Oh, perfect! I have these items of that type. You should place them in the cafe when you get time. Okay. Let's go check out the cafe. Uh, open the door, please. Ah, ooh. F for furniture. Ooh. Yeah, I definitely need to get a controller that can work with this. Um. Where are my furniture items? Hmm. I think we should have a table by the window. Oh, that, that stores it, my bad. There we go. Hi, in the middle of this window. Oop, there we go. Dang it, I did it again. There we go. What's up here? No. Huh. Oh, is this our little bedroom? But why am I running like that? Alright, um, what now? Hi, oh, I want to pet you. Oh, yes. Alright, hi, can I talk to you? Hmm, okay, what's next? Animals! Your aunt always had a bunch of cute, cuddly animals in the cafe. Honestly, it is the best part of the whole thing. Why don't you look around and adopt an animal for the cafe? Normally you should avoid wild animals, but the magic of this island has made them all super friendly and cuddly. You could pick up any animal and use the animal command to tell them to follow you or go to the cafe. Your animal journal keeps track of all the animals you've yet and let them, lets you give them names, summon them to your party, and give them hats. Okay, let's go explore! Is that a fox? Oh no, it's another kitty. Hi, kitty, kitty. Oh, you look like my kitty in real life. A little ginger. Hi, tiger. Here, pick, 
you're coming with me. <laughs> We're, I'm kidnapping this cat. You are mine. <laughs> Welcome to your new home, tiger. Uh. Go to the cafe. You're already here. Welcome, tiger. Yeah, we got a little kitty. Let's kidnap the calico, too. Where are ya? Come here. Welcome. Come with me. Place you in here. Good kitty. Who wants a toy? What are they doing? What happened to them? Oh dear. Uh, let's not play with that toy anymore for now. I'm back. I kidnapped two cats. What's the last thing? I can't seem to recall. Oh, food! Duh! Okay, so the other thing you need to learn is making food for the cafe. Can't have a cafe without cafe food and drinks. Your aunt left you a couple recipes, but it's not many. I'm sure if you talk to the other villagers, they may be able to share some family recipes with you in exchange for your help. But for now, why don't you head to the kitchen and try out one of those recipes? Uh, I only have one option. Sounds good. Oh, something else to note. This magic is very much based in old magic. The way we do things is a bit different here. I think you'll really enjoy the cooking, though. It's pretty fun to throw an egg at the size of your whole body. Sorry, what? Oh, you'll see. Go try it out. Um, I kind of don't want to. Tiger, Calico, boy. Do you want a toy? La, 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 la. Oh, no. Okay, that toy just makes them collapse. I don't understand why. Make food. Cupcake, coffee, macaroon. Start recipe. Put the- What the heck? What? Okay, uh, whoa. Pick up the flower. Who orchestrated this? This is so cool. Uh, eh. Um, eh. No! Come here, come here. Don't you dare think about eating me, Calico. Uh, place. No! Let's just throw it. Huh. There we go. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be difficult. Uh, where's the sugar? Sugar? Ah! Huh. And then an egg. Huh. Oh, nice. Oh! No wonder my aunt retired. Imagine having to cook all your food this way. Whoa! What happened? All right, let's do that. Let's make more. I want to mess with that. Okay. Um. Coffee. All right. We need coffee beans. We'll just throw all of it in there. No need to ground them up. Milk. Aha. Dun 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 dun. Huh. No. Oh, okay. There's a border. Huh. Oh. Huh. No. Huh. No. Oh, I missed again. Where did it go? Oh, it's over there now. How did it get over there? All right, you're driving me crazy. Huh. Oh, hi, tiger. Ignore me. Oh, jeez. Must have the strength of an ant. Oh, okay. One last thing. Cupcake. Alright, we need flour. Yeah. Da, 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 da. Sugar. Oh, you know what this reminds me of? That scene in Infinity Train Season 4 where Ryan and Min Gi had to make the food for Pig Baby. This is exactly what that's like. And Pig Baby was played by J.K. Simmons. Freaking love J.K. Simmons. Everything he's in, he's a delight. Except Omni Man. I mean, J.K. Simmons is still a delight, but Omni Man? Jeez. Dun dun dun. Blink! Alright, there we go. Alright, let's go talk to the mayor. Hi. Oh, I'm so proud of you. You're a natural. I guess all that's left is meeting some of your neighbors. 
Once you've met someone, they will start coming to the cafe whenever they have free time in their schedule. When people visit your cafe, they'll buy the food you've made, even when you aren't there. Your magical food stock is infinite, so don't worry about making new food every day. However, the townsfolk all have different tastes, so if you change up the food in your display case, they may tip you more for their favorites. Unfortunately, we had some problems traveling to and from other areas of the island, which sucks. I haven't been able to get to the hot springs for months. Maybe one of the villagers has an idea for how to fix up some of the blockades. Anyway, I hope you get the cafe back up and running. If you ever want to chat to me about it, you can find me or anyone else you've met on your map. See ya, friendo! Alright, bye bye Open for business! Alright, let's go meet some villagers. And then after that, I think we'll probably call it a day. The beginning of games are always tough, because you have to meet everyone and get used to the controls. Oh, there's a crow! Can I steal the crow? Come here, you bastard. I want you in my cafe. Come here. Come here. Come here. What's a raven? Ha ha! Uh, store. Oh! <laughs> what the heck? Hush, raven. Oh, who is this? Oh, another raven. Hi! Come here. Pick up crow. Oh, it's a crow. Okay. Uh, go to the cafe. Where are you going? Go to the cafe. No, you're coming with me. That's it. I have a crow and a raven. Hello, I am have birds. I have bird. Hi. Whoa, who are you? Greetings, traveler, and welcome to my palatal emporium of potent, potable, portable, pourable potions. I'm Potum. Autumn. I'm Autumn. So, sorry, I don't have any potions available right now. My cat Char is missing and I have no idea where she is. And the worry has gotten me totally behind on making potions. Um, do you want... Birds? I can give you some birds. Let me just store this animal as well. Oh, is that... Where's your cat? Let me find your cat for you. I thought I saw it. You know what? I can't find your cat. I have other things to worry about. Let's jump! Whoa! Whoa, we're flying! This is beautiful! We're flying! Oh my god, we're so graceful! Guys, I'm your new neighbor and I can fly! Hello, townsfolk. How are you? Who are you? You there! You look like a person that appreciates a good flower, and we appreciate people that appreciate good flowers, because good flowers is what we've got. Eh, I don't get to practice my sales pitch new pe on two new people very often, but you get the idea. I'm Lily. I help my pops run the flower store. That's nice. I collect birds. Oh, are you pops? I like your flower beard. Well, now look who it is. It's been so long since I've seen you, and you've grown up from a sprout to a sunflower. Dot dot dot. We've never met before, have we? Oh, thank goodness, I thought I'd just forgotten. The name's Poppy. I run the flower shop along with my daughter Lily. You can never have too many flowers. I, my motto is you can never have too many birds. Hello! Oh, you're on the cover art, aren't you? Hiya! I'm Sunny. Blossom and I are so excited about the Cat Cafe reopening. It's where we first met. I thought about running the cafe myself, but that would have spoiled the magic for me. Besides, I'd rather run the Boardwalk Arcade. You think I get a high score on every machine if I legally own the place? Uh, sure. Where's Blossom? I want to meet Blossom. Oh, hi, Blossom. Do you like birds? Because I have... Do I have a deal for you? Is that another bird? No, that's a cat. Dang it. Are you Blossom? Oh, um, hello. You must be the new cat cafe owner. Kiva offered to let me take care of the cafe, but it turns out cats are very different from flowers. <laughs> they both require a lot of love, but cats don't like getting watered. Oh, my name's Blossom, by the way. It's nice to meet you. If you ever want to plant your roots and soak up some sun, you can visit the garden Sunny and I share on the hill. Uh, I'll do that, and I'll bring my birds! Whee! Is anyone here? I have birds! Oh, they won't let me in. Hello? Hello? I have bird. Hi, who are you? Oh my gosh, are you the new cat cafe owner? I've been so excited to meet you! This is the best day ever! My name's Maribel, and I own the fashion store in town. You should come by and see my clothes. You would look amazing in them. You already look amazing. I love your outfit. But you can have always have more. I'm not wearing anything. I just have birds. Hi. Do you like my birds? Oh my. What do we have here? A new customer. Or should I say, a new neighbor? You're the one that took over that old cat cafe, aren't you? 
I always admire the industrious spirit. I'm sure we'll get along famously. Please have a look around my store. You'll need to furnish that cafe if you want customers. Uh, I have my birds, thank you. Hello! I like your hair. Hey, always cool to see a fresh face around here. I'm Ash. I am work the general store. I guess I'm Estelle's assistant. I don't always get her, but I've learned more magic from her than I ever did in magic school, so this job isn't the worst. <laughs> There's a magic school? I should go to it. I have a way with birds. Pink haired person. Oh, <gasps> is that another cat or is that a raccoon? Oh, <gasps> it's a little red panda! Hi! Do you want to come with me? Hey. Oh, need anything? We should really get the paths to the mountains to open up so everyone in town can visit their friends here. Oh, uh, yeah, hang on. Pick up Panda. Hi! Help, let me pick you. Hi, Patches. Hang on, I need my birds. Are you okay? You're mine. I'm out of here. Later, scrub. Are you Char? Oh, you're a... Oh, you're a doggy! I'll come back and get you later. Let's get dark. <gasps> what the heck is that? What the heck is that? What's... What the... What the... What the what? What the what? That's a giant freaking cat, man! How did that... Why can't I get down here? There's a giant cat! Hey, crow! The crow's trying to escape! Get him! Get him! <laughs> Come here! Come here! Accept your fate! He's probably running because he's like, what the hell is that giant cat? It's not really a cat cafe, is it? I just have birds. And two cats. Two cats, two birds. I can foresee this not going wrong at all. Hello! Place the crow. And... Uh... Ah, animals. Crow. Raven? Cafe. How do I get you off me? Raven, get- Oh, there we go. Uh, place, there you go. Nice! Hmm, should we grab anything else? Maybe if there's something nearby. Ooh, what's this place? Do you have animals for me to kidnap? Hello, Meredith there, my name's Maya. I'm vice president of the Owl Club at your service. Oh, but I'm sorry, I'm the vice president of nothing right now. There was a landslide that blocked the path into the mountains. If we can't go to the mountains, it means we can't go to the Owl Club headquarters. And if we can't go to the Owl Club headquarters, that means you can't meet Freya. She's the president of the Owl Club, and the president of my heart. Aww. I'm in a real pickle of beans right now, is what I'm saying. Oh no, what's wrong? Is this about the mountain blockage? I don't know if Kiva mentioned this to you, but there's a landslide at the entrance of the Snowbell Mountains. It's such a bummer. Can I help? Oh my gosh, that would be amazing! I have no idea how you can help, but if you can find a way through, I promise you can be a prestigious member of our Owl Club. I asked everyone in town to help, but no one could help, except for Autumn. I haven't asked her yet. She lives in the bottle on top of the hill next to your cafe. I'm really high- it's really high up and I'm scared of heights. I know that seems weird for an owl-based magical girl, but I can't actually fly. Uh, actually you can if you just kidnap a bird and jump off a high cliff. I mean, I didn't know that until I tested it, and it might only work with ravens, but uh, sometimes you just gotta make a leap for it. Girl? Whee! Like that. <gasps> is that a dog? Oh my goodness, yes it is! Come here, you're mine. Ha ha! Oh wait, the red panda! Uh, yeah, store animal. And let's grab the red panda as well. Come here! <laughs> He's like, oh shit! <laughs> She's coming! <laughs> Alright, let's get back. Okay, okay. Let us, uh, place the red panda. 
and um and place the doggy. Welcome everyone to your new home. I think we're going to end it here for today. This game is really charming and really cute. I like it and I like the aesthetic and all the animals that you can pick up. Um, I might wait to play it again until I have a controller that actually works with my PC because uh, I bet this runs or plays a lot smoother with the controls like they recommended. I just didn't have one on hand and I wanted to play this. But we may play it again sooner than later. So look out for that. Thanks to Sylvia Wood for recommending this game. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please consider subscribing. Remember to take care of yourself and have a good day.